this is Anthony with Diesel Laptops. Today I'm going to be hooking into a 2013 Isuzu using the Isuzu IDSS software and the Isuzu IDS adapter. Now in order to connect to an Isuzu using, using the software here, what you want to do is first identify whether you're using an automatic or manual transmission. For this one here, we are using a automatic. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to click on the automatic transmission button. And once you click on this, it'll only take a few seconds to connect. And then what you want to do from here is simply click scan tool. Once you're here at scan tool, to get your DTCs out, you just want to click on DTCs here. Give this a little bit. And right here, right here, you should be getting all of your DTCs appearing right here on the right. Now for, now for your bi-directional commands, like your, let's say your region, what you want to do here is actually go to output control test, and you want to go to the engine control module. Uh, once here, you'll see this is where all of your activation tests are located. What we got here, you see a few of the commands we have. And you see here, this is where you also find your region if you needed to do one. Now for this one, it is gathering data from this truck. Right now we have, the truck is just in the on position. So we're not gonna be able to run a region right now, but, but uh, once we have this crank, cranked up, we could easily run a region from this screen right here. Um, some other things to note, this is also where you can reset your DPF data. If so, say if you want to, if you just installed a new, a new filter onto this, onto this truck, this is where you reset the data to let it know that you have inserted a new filter. Alright, alright, that concludes this video for today. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day.